Uh, my name is Anthony Mathis. Um, I'm from Westland, Oregon, and obviously I'm a senior. Some of my favorite memories of this season are obviously being the number six team in the country, which was Nevada at the time. Um, and then some ones in the previous um, are just behind the scenes, just spending time with teammates and, you know, just the t times that we hang out back at the apartment. Um, I'll cherish those forever. For sure. There's criminology right now. and. Um, after I'm done playing basketball, hopefully, um, if I'm fortunate enough to play basketball at the professional level, um, I want to do something in a crim criminal investigation. Um, so some behind the scenes stuff, trying to figure out some uh, crimes that are pretty serious. Um, I think that'd be su super cool. Uh, being in level, it's just being persistent, um, having perseverance, sticking the course, um, never giving up. Um, at times it's going to be tough. Obviously there's fingers that you can point at other people to um, try to put the blame on, but at the end of the day it comes back to yourself. Uh, so you just got to stay uh, level-headed, never get too high, never get too low, and just keep on grinding. My current teammates, I would say um, everything's not going to come right away. Um, I know coming in as a freshman and a sophomore, I expected to come in and just score right away. And obviously that's not how it played out, um, but I stayed patient. And um, it, it, obviously my time came, and uh, I'm so fortunate everything happened the way it did. Um, it's just all about patience. You can never want it to happen overnight because things that happen overnight is is not ideal. I want to leave here, um, you know, really not getting to contribute very much. And then Coach Weir obviously came in and I, I really caught on to his philosophy of everybody touches the ball. Um, he, he lets you do whatever you want on offense as long as you play your heart out on defense. Um, obviously, I'm not the best defender in the world, but I, I, at the end of the day, I can say I try my hardest. Um, whether that plays out great or not, um, it's, it's, it's just the way it stacks up sometimes, but I truly do give it everything I have. And uh, that's what I really like about Coach Weir. He'll run through a wall for you, um, and I do the same for him. And he truly cares about his players and the relationship he has with them. He truly puts so much into this, to the game that, I mean, I, I just take, take blame. That's the kind of person I am. I want to put everything on myself and not blame others. And um, it was super hard, but um, I, I wouldn't trade it for the world. I love being a leader on this team, and I love my teammates for allowing me the opportunity to do so. Uh, same with coaches, and I, I just I love being a part of this, this program. I would just tell my coaches thank you. I mean, they've let, helped me grow so much these past four years, not even as a player I'm speaking about, just as a person. I mean, Coach Weir, Coach Harry, um, Jerome, B. Mace, they've all helped me so much grow as a person. And uh, they're, they've, the things they've done for me and for this team are beyond anything I could ever ask for somebody to do. The time they put in for us is remarkable, and I just truly want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I just want to say I appreciate you guys, everything you guys have done. Uh, the sacrifices that you guys took for me to get even to get the opportunity to play at an amazing university like um, here in New Mexico and uh, just the time, money, everything. Just I'm super appreciative that everything they've done. My girlfriend Alyssa's family, um, they've been here since day one. Um, it's funny, I always think back to my freshman and sophomore year when um, I was never getting on the court and never playing. Um, I would just tell them oftentimes, you guys, you guys just need to stay home. Like, don't even come out to the game. It's just gonna be a waste of time. Um, you're gonna waste gas. It's gonna be parking's gonna be crazy. So don't even come. Um, and every single day, they would just demand me to leave them tickets, um, just in case I did get that chance to get on the court. They would always be there to support me, and uh, it's amazing. I appreciate it.